Okay, back to this tutorial. We're turning um, this HTML file. We've saved it as a PHP file, and we're turning it into basically a, um, a Joomla template. So in the body here, it says uh, div, ID, header, and all that stuff here. I'm going to go to the content main area, div, ID, content wrapper, content main. This is my main content, and I'm going to um, delete the lorem ipsum text and the paragraph that says this is my main content. So now you've just got the div opening ID equals content main and then the end div tag. And in there what you're going to do is put the JDoc uh, statement, which is a Joomla statement. There we go. JDoc include type component. And that's going to put in the main component for Joomla that will um, that is the main content area for your um, website, your Joomla website. So instead of having um, your text in here in the content main div, Joomla will go out and will fill in the content from the MySQL database. Okay, then in the um, div ID content secondary, we're going to do the same thing. Delete the text. So now we just have our empty div. And this time, I'm going to put in a JDoc modules statement. Okay, there it is. JDoc colon include type equals modules name top. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the name to the, the type of module that I'm going to be putting in here, which in this case would probably be something named right. Okay. Then the left column, same thing. I'm going to delete the text out of there. So I have an empty div ID left, and I'm going to paste in JDoc include type modules, and name will be left. Okay, and for the footer as well, just highlight that and paste, and name will be footer. Okay, so that's cool. So these are going to refer to the different modules that are going to get. Um, that Joomla is going to reference and then stick into our site. Okay, now we didn't we skipped the header area. The header area is a little different. Uh, uh, in the header area, I've got this unordered list called nav main, and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete this piece right here. And now it just says unordered list ID equals nav main. I'm going to change it to a div. So I'll say div space ID equals nav main. I need to end this div. Alright, that sounds good. And in there, I'm going to put a module. And I'll make this module called, I'll mimic the same name, nav-main. And that's where my main navigation will go. But the navigation is going to be inserted by Joomla, not an unordered list, hard-coded right into the page. And then in my header, I've got div ID header. Then I have an image tag to my, my header logo. That's cool. I'm going to leave that there. I want that in there. Then I made up a special other div for the image on the right. And I, I think I want to leave that in there too. But what I might do is right after the logo, I might stick another div. So what I'll do is I'll call it um, I'll stick another div in there. Copy that I haven't styled yet. Div, I'll call it top. All right, and then I need to end that div. Right, and then I've got inside of it, so there's my div ID equals top, and I've got a JDoc statement in here. Uh, JDoc include type modules name top. I like that. So now and maybe I'll have some content in there like a, a search bar or a login box or something like that. It's in the top module. So um, basically all of these JDoc includes type modules. These are going to be all of the um, modules, all of the sections basically of your Joomla site. Um, the different areas where you can stick content. Okay. All right, that's looking pretty good. Um, I'm happy with that. 
So I'll call, I'll say file, save. Now if we look at it in the browser, it's going to be all messed up. Okay, so there's the, um, there's my original HTML page. There's my second HTML page, the one we were working on. And now I'm going to make a new tab over here and say file, open file. And now we've got index2.php. And there it is. You can see there's, it's not styled correctly and um, things aren't working quite right now.